Hello everyone. This video is about useful research apps and websites. Number one is Google Scholar. You can download the research papers using Google Scholar. Google Scholar is quick and simple to use. Google Scholar can lead to hundreds of relevant scholarly publications in seconds. Search for any topic you want and it will display results in seconds with source link and PDF. You can also download the PDF for your references. So good right? You can also see the most cited research paper for your research work and it also has cited by function. Citations in MLA format, APA format, Chicago, Harvard are also present. You can copy the style you want and paste it in your references. Second one is Skyhub. Skyhub is a website that acts as a shadow library providing free access to millions of academic papers and books. Search for any topic in Google or Google Scholar or in Research Wait. If there is PDF available in these websites, it is well ended. If not, copy the link or DOI and paste it in the Skyhub. For example, here I am searching for supply chain. You can see that PDFs are available for research for some research papers and for some it's not. So I am copying the DOI and pasting in the Skyhub. So here it is the DOI. Copy that and paste it in the Skyhub. Control C. For pasting it as control V, right? <coughs> so, tada! You can see the results here, and also you can download the PDF for your references. That's all about Skyhub. Do you know how to lower the plagiarism for easy publication of your paper? Then, Quillbot makes it easier for you. Quillbot rewrites the sentences which greatly aids in plagiarism detention and also it summarizes the content which is beneficial for creating abstracts and also for reading research articles. For example here I am using the content from Google Scholar. So I am going to Google Scholar and here I am searching for Likert scale. So I need to rewrite the copied content from this PDF. So I'm using the content here. I'm using the introduction here. So I'm going to copy it. And I'm pasting in the quill box. Here the results will be displayed within the seconds. So it rewrites sentences and it also have modes like standard, fluency, former, simple, creative, expand and shorten. You can also use the synonym slider here. Based on your liking, edit it and copy in your final research document. That's all about Curlbot. Next one is MS Word or Google Docs. I think you all know about it. So, no need to explain these uses for you, right? So, if you want that, please comment below. I will explain it. If you are afraid of grammar mistakes and spelling mistakes while writing research paper, then Grammarly comes in hand. Grammarly corrects the mistakes you have written in research, research paper and it is also very useful app for writing research paper and also for business communications. Hurry and download the Grammarly app in your PC and mobile phone and use it for writing research paper and improve your writing skills. It also helpful for writing the emails it corrects your spelling mistakes and grammar mistakes you have written and it is also a very helpful app for improving your English writing skills. That's all about Grammarly. 
for collecting data when making a questionnaire, right? For easy making a questionnaire, you can use Google Forms. So go to the Google Forms and take blank form and add your title, description, etc. Based on your questionnaire, make it. There are also many choices available. Others and multiple choices are available. Long answers, short answers are also available. Check boxes are also available here. According to your liking, make the questionnaire. And you can also share this questionnaire via mail and other social media app. It also helps in analyzing the collected data. You can also use Excel for analyzing the data you have collected. Thank you.